Talk about saving the best for last. Now that's what I'm talking about. Holy hell, she's cute. Yeah, she is. They agree on something for once. Oh man, this is insane. If we nail this, it'll blow our failures out of the water. How about this time? We try going one by one instead of all together. All right, I'm in. Okay, and let's decide the order. We'll go clockwise, starting with the winner. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors. Uh, they're hiding the results. Oh, get a pig. Okay. Hmm. Well, this calls me for some reason. I lost. Ah, oh, come on. Dude, you are shouting. She's gonna turn around. Okay, I'll go first. So not a sign a second, and you'll go last. Okay, so yeah, you have to get these results. All right. Here goes. Uh, hey, I notice you've been uh, staring at the ocean. So, um, you here with anyone? My name's J Junpei. Oh. Stutter. Did you pay? Oh, wow. <clears throat> um, I was just wondering if you'd be down the top. If you're not busy. I'm sorry, I'll pick my job the off the floor. This is the first time I heard their voice. Goodness. I mean, <laughs> it's more fun than standing here all by yourself, right? I am looking for someone. Uh, oh, yeah? Aren't we all, sister? <laughs> you are not that someone. I'd just cry. I'd be honest, I would cry. But at least she's straightforward about it. Wow. You got shot down faster than I expected. She's a tough one, Senpai. <laughs> Don't worry about me. I never lose! <laughs> Do you like the uh, motion? He is smooth. You got it. He's smoother than his legs. Oh my god! Is your question directed at me? <sighs> oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I like the ocean. I, you know, I heard something interesting about triathletes who train at indoor pools. Apparently, they get outperformed by athletes who train in the ocean. That information is irrelevant to me. Uh, oh, I you know for the record, Aki, I thought it was cool information. She's just not she's just not for you, bro. <laughs> well, I was. <laughs> I talked to her longer than you did. <laughs> what I say, I never lose. It doesn't matter how long you talk to her. <sighs> this sucks. You could cry. There, there, Junpei. Hey, don't cry. Uh, you're making me feel bad. I thought this flinging thing was supposed to be fun. Like... Well, that's where we are. If you can't pull this off, I'm going to be traumatized for the rest of my life. Jeez, no pressure. We're on the ropes, but it's not over yet. It's all up to you now. Whatever. <laughs> no one replies. <laughs> What should I say? Yo. Hello, baby. How we doing tonight? <laughs> you are so cool. <laughs> I can hear what he said. But she looks surprised. We should go over there. <sighs> Initiating evasive maneuver. Confirmation must be made at a secure location. Was it the hair flip? It was the hey, hair flip. What did you say to make her run away like that? I said, hey, baby, you are cool. Well, what are you waiting for? Go after her. Why do I have to? I think that's stalking. I, uh, but it wasn't my fault. Yeah, you're right. I should say sorry for being so cool in your presence. This could turn into serious <laughs> trouble. You gotta huh? go tell her you're sorry. Wait, what? Well, oh my God, you're, uh, he's spinning. If you don't, we'll get all the blame. Go on. Catch her if you hurry. Catch her? What am I? Man, I'm gonna end up on a list. All right, we're going into the forest. Friggin' dude. 
sweaty guy. He said it was gonna work. Uh. The way she just started off is odd. Now, I'm not sure what you said to her, but you better clear up the misunderstanding. Damn, they, he, he, dude, he's like actually mad at me. I'm sorry, bro. I, I suck at this. Come on, go after her. Get on your knees, beg for forgiveness, and introduce her to me. <laughs> Please. <laughs> You're just the worst. Please don't tell on me. I'm gonna get in trouble. <laughs> Why is she running like that? <sighs> I should go after her and clear up the misunderstanding. She. I mean. You know, usually girls run away from me, but not that fast. I. Uh, I can't get over that. She's, she's, she's flooping around. Flooping ain't even a verb. Or is it? I don't have time to think about that. Uh. Are we there yet? No, they're just gonna keep showing me. Yeah, it's a trail. There's only one way she can go. Freaking, I should go after. Her. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying. Mm, ooh, a cedar tree. That's cool, and also a dead end. The heck, you? Oh, uh, I lost sight of the girl. Mm, never mind. I got her. She must be the one who's watching me. Staring contest, go. <laughs> you lose. You broke. You broke. You broke stance. Can't do no, that. Oh, I am certain. Oh, oh, oh. I have found you. I have been searching for you. Wait, are you the girl I was playing hide and seek with in first grade? My highest priority is to be at your side. <laughs> what? Freaking kidding me? Jupay didn't hate his. <laughs> he does now. <laughs> What's going on? He didn't even say anything to her. It doesn't seem like she wants to let go. There you guys are. <gasps> oh no. What are you doing here? We've been looking all over for you. Um. What are you doing in the middle of the woods in your swimsuit? This is so. Can I? Can I like turn around? Like I'm just. I'm just frozen here. You have no idea what we've. Huh? Who's this? And why does she have a chokehold on this guy? And why is she hugging you? I don't know. I can't move. I'm scared, Yukari. Get get a doctor. Listen, we have a slight situation here. I'm sorry to interrupt your vacation, but I need everyone to go back to the house and gear up. Ah, uh, that won't be necessary. We found what we were looking for. Mr. Chairman, what do you mean? Oh my god, can I- can I just- can you stop? Can you let go of me? Hm. You had me worried. You can't just leave the lab on your own, I guess. Thank god. Understood. Oh, Jesus. So yeah, surprise, surprise, they're looking for the... For, for... I guess. Sorry for all the trouble. Everything is under control now. What happened to securing the tank? Oh, that's been taken care of. I guess, join us over here. Understood. I think she loves saying that. This is Igus. As you can see, she's a machine with the form and face of a human girl. I am Igus. My objective is to exterminate shadows. I have been assigned to seize, effective immediately. No way. It's like she's alive. This is unbelievable. How can a robot be this cute? <laughs> What a cruel world. You have not been paying attention to pop fiction, my man. That's the norm. Ten years ago, a plan was enacted to create anti-shadow weapons. A contingency in the event a shadow became unmanageable. Igis was the last one to be made. And she's the only one that still remains today. An anti-shadow weapon? Does that mean she has a persona too? Correct. I am capable of wielding the persona called Palladian. She suffered major damage in combat her first year out, and she's been kept in the lab ever since. 
I'm still not sure as to why she suddenly reactivated herself this morning. In any case, I hope you'll all get along. An anti-shadow weapon. Possessing a will all her own. This is amazing! <laughs> Uh, if you don't mind me asking, when we first saw you earlier, you were, uh, oh. hugging our leader. I just now realized, yeah, that is... Right after the night with Yukari? Oh, God. I can explain? Do you know him? I can't explain that. Yes, it is very important for me to be by his side. <sighs> hmm. Maybe her facial recognition system is malfunctioning. Or maybe she's still half asleep. Very interesting. Hmm. Uh. Can I. Can, can, can I, like, go? Like, what are we doing? Like. Half asleep? What's going on? It sounds like you're half asleep, Akutsuki. Hmm. Well, I can ponder this later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyhow, I forgot to mention. Did you know there are a wide range of recreational facilities you can use here? There are? There's a tennis court, a pool table, and even a karaoke machine. No way. Can we, can we go? Would anyone care to hear me sing? I'm more of a table tennis kind of guy. Yeah, not me. Uh, you know. Uh, I'll pass, man. No, thank you. Okay. Can we, can we, can we actually play table tennis? Like, you know, so. It was just kind of the beach before, but now, I don't know. Like, oh, we're back on the beach. I Man, it's fine, I guess. Man, I can't believe it's already the third day of our trip. Yeah, time is flying. We uh did the beach fling thing, and then we saw the cedar tree. It's really been packed. Like, it's too bad we have to go home tomorrow. I'd totally stay longer if I could, but I can't complain too much. You went through a hell of a lot here. Yeah, like hearing you and the chairman sing. Oh. <laughs> I barely got any sleep last night. <laughs> so even though he said, ah, he still took him up on the offer. Junpei. He won't admit it, but he has having fun. Uh, oh, oh! Do we have a mission at the beach today? Kinda? Nah, it's nothing like that. We just came here to have some fun. That is the objective, though. You know. Do you understand what it means to have fun, I guess? Because I don't either. Yes, I am informed of the concept. Recreation is sustenance for one's mental well-being. Yeah, exactly! Wow, you sure know a lot about us humans. Alright, let's take one last dip before we leave. Uh, oh. wait. Junpei-kun? Yeah, she just dashed right in. Is it okay for I guess to go in the water? I'm sure she's fine. Oh, are you done already? It is best that everyone partake in this activity together. Dang, she's formulated the best way to have fun already. She is good. Deriving enjoyment alone is not the oh. optimal method to have fun. <laughs> <laughs> You've got some strong feelings on pretty weird things, don't you? But what the heck, might as well. Yeah, your car is down. You're getting along. Off screen. We should join them. Yeah. Let's <laughs> Agreed. Let's go. Uh. Can we get to see this? Oh, come on. You wear the suit that. Enjoying yourselves. You really don't own any shorts, Akutsuki? Quite a lot's happened during our time here. But it looks like we'll get to relax a bit today. <laughs> that would be nice. Sonata Sun! What are you doing? Come on, it's your turn. My turn? What are they doing? <laughs> Glad to see everyone's having so much fun. I've already told you what time the ship is arriving tomorrow, right? I'll probably head over to the port early, so don't be late. Okay, I'll let everyone know. We can get back to business once we've returned to the dorm. Got it. Oh, he's not gonna call me. I mean, you know, you're not dressed for it. All right, I guess we should join too. <laughs> you know, this guy has a wetsuit under his suit. Oh uh, my! Way, that's not what water that is, dude. She just got a 
be firing faster than a pressure washer. That would... Oh my god. <laughs> Junpei -kun is down. That was a... Everyone stop on him. <laughs> all right. Here's our chance for an all-out attack. <laughs> they actually say that. Let's get him. <laughs> what? <laughs> what did we do? He's dead. We had a fun killing. We had a lot of fun killing Junpei. I guess joining things are getting a lot livelier. All right, a new scene. Whoa, okay, okay. New scene actually got a giggle out of me. What can I say? I chortle nonstop. It is what it is. It's one of my favorite games, y'all. Oh, but just oh, over too soon. Hey, what's up, fun? You know, have, I, I, oh. <laughs> what is this? You seem to be in great pain. All right. <sighs> you again. Shit, it's them. You mean those three? Ugh, they're freaky. Tough chick, you are in firing range. I would, I would not say that. Shut up. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Said a lot ruder, but same effect. Why do they always run and hide at the sight of me? <laughs> They're like back alley rats. <sighs> Beats me. Jin, give him the capsules. <laughs> Thanks. I'll pay you the usual way. Now hold up. This time, we'd like your payment in the form of information. Your acquaintances have been busy lately. I'm referring to their activities on nights when the moon is full, of course. They've spent a great deal of time in the tower as well. I wonder, why did they take this burden upon themselves? Hmm. You do know, don't you? But you don't wish to say. Is it perhaps because... You're one of them? I'm not. I've got nothing to do with them anymore. Then tell us. I'm sure you'd agree these pills are more important than a group you have nothing to do with. <sighs> I don't know the details, but supposedly, destroying all those creatures will put an end to the Dark Hour. And that weird-ass tower will disappear. It's all I know, all right. You mean, they intend to eliminate the Dark Hour completely? Why would they do such a thing? To give up such power? <sighs> to destroy the Tower of Demise. Tower of Demise? Who wouldn't want to take out that damn thing? <laughs> it's a freaking eyesore. Yes, I know. And off they go. <sighs> Can't go back. I won't use my power again. Not after last time. Well, someone's not having a fun time at the beach, that's for sure. Man, I'm beat. And sunburned. And there's welts all over my back, thanks to Igus. Oh, well. Seemed to take forever to get back. Oh, hello. It was a tiring trip. Please rest up so you're ready for the next operation. Yeah. There's six more left to fight, right? Just the last full moon shadows and things will go back to normal. No more apathy syndrome incidents, just plain old everyday life. Let's do our best. After all, we're the only ones who can help. Heck yeah. I'll we'll tear it up. Come to think of it, the crops. Dude, enough about the crops. We didn't get home in time. The trains, they're already, uh, the kitty. That's all I care about. Also, real talk, I don't know if I missed any of these. I've not been checking my phone lately. My bad. If I missed one, I don't know. We'll show it in bonus videos, or maybe I can just, I don't boot up an old save file. Show it that way. A little out of order. She looks like a normal girl, as long as she doesn't do anything too weird. But if she does, 
think anyone figure out that she's actually a robot? Depends if they look at her feet. But I mean, who would do that? Maybe not. Most people probably aren't look out for undercover robots. Yeah. Unless they have uh, issues. She's super cute, huh? She's super cute and made out of steel. Dang, he already moved on from Fuka. Man. What happened to loyalty? It's new territory for me, and honestly, I don't know how to approach this. Uh, I could get her some WD-40. She might like that. <laughs> oh, goodness. An anti-shadow weapon. That will be the most welcome addition. Most souvenirs are useless. Snow globes, keychains, postcards. That's not true. I get, I get my mom magnets all the time. She loves them. However, this souvenir from Yakushima is très bien. Ugh. <laughs> Everyone seems worn out. You must be exhausted. Let's not go to Tartarus tonight. I'm gonna do that crap anyway. Greetings. These are your lodging quarters. Very well. I shall remain by your side at all times. She's still far from passing as a human. Doesn't look like she'll understand ordinary feelings and conversation yet. She could. And be able to form a bond with her. Foreshadowing. I thought of a bid the other day. What if I just... You know, listen, when you make so many walkthroughs, you just, you know, can only do the straight man thing so many times. I'm just going to start messing with people. Even if I don't, like, and I'm playing a new game, just say foreshadowing when it's not. People are like, wait. Does, what, does he know? But then there's a the chance I do that and it actually was foreshadowing and then everyone thinks I'm a liar. Hmm. Is there something you'd like to know about Igus? Dude, tell me everything. Where are the others? I'm curious. I assume you're referring to the other anti-shadow weapons. Yes. Well, there were quite a few created. You would say they were Igus's siblings. However, they were all destroyed 10 years ago in the incident. Igus has been quite lonely since then. Bummer. The incident? I wonder what he means. Why is she so human? I mean, surely could have, you know, could have made her look like a Gundam. Well, that was actually the earliest design, and well, yeah, you know, we just kind of went from there. A persona is a product of the human psyche. So the plan had to be to place a human mind inside an anti-shadow weapon. The only real issue was the form that weapon would take. We used a tank, for instance. The weapon's mind wouldn't recognize itself as such. And a contract wait, contradiction would arise. As we all know, a tank is not a living entity. A human mind trying to reconcile its existence in this way would break down before you could blink. So, how do you prevent that contradiction? You see where I'm going with this, don't you? Yes. Why don't you give her a feed if that's the case? I do not possess toes. Contradiction. Syntax error. Like, I get it. When giving a, <laughs> when giving a body that more closely resembles the expectation of mind, the spirit stabilizes. That is why I guess and her siblings were built in the form of human beings. And, uh, it, it was no other reason. Okay. And they genuinely cleaned that up. I was kind of wondering that. How come she knows me? It was, it was like when, somebody on the development team, they look like me? I couldn't say. Perhaps it's a bug in her facial recognition programming. I'm sure it's nothing to concern yourself with. You're not worrying over much, are you? <laughs> Don't think about it. Well, about that. A lot of people are joining the team, huh? Big difference from a while back. Yeah, now we have like... So many mouths to feed. Wait, no. Not actually, because I guess it doesn't count. Maybe she drinks gasoline? I don't know. Oh, snap, it's open today. What the heck is that? Is that a ch <laughs> Your chakras? <laughs> you know, I'm gonna- I should deliver the driftwood first. Mitsuru saying souvenirs are useless. I disagree. Wait, what? Um... I guess we could do that. A shame. I'm terribly sorry, but I'm afraid it will have to wait for another day. Oh, she turned down our invitation. Honestly, probably for the best. They are a little tired. So we'll just, you know, request? report this. Oh, I actually... Oh, dump! I didn't know that was a thing I had to buy from the Shady Commodities. But yeah, let's turn these in. It seems you're complete request. Oh, I see you're carrying something related to the ocean. May I have one? 
yeah, yeah, knock yourself out. Here's a shell. Oh my. What a beautiful shell. I profess. It is deeply moving knowing that something so enchanting was sculpted by nature. How splendid. She is really liking the shell. Thank you. Because of your stories and your lovely souvenirs, I was able to experience the ocean myself. Please take this. Dang, I wonder what happens if we give her the other things. Oh, we can't? Darn it. I wanted to give her the driftwood. Dump. Oh, well. Here's a Christmas star. That red leaf plant. Is that the Christmas star? I was led to believe there would be presents growing from this plant. Well, oh, well. This fulfills my request. They could take it back with you. Although, once the presents are in bloom, I'd like for these plants to fill a room. <laughs> Jack's close. Yo! Jack. Close. All right, we're using Akihiko. Next hardest run, absolutely. And yo, here's your, here's your air palms, girl. So these are the sought-after max safety shoes. They seem like ordinary pair of shoes. Oh, perhaps that his intended purpose will only reveal itself in a crisis. In that case, I'll be returning these. I'm sure they'll be most, most useful to you. Okay, that was kind of you know, kind of went without saying. Still, Twilight Fragment's pretty good, though. And Bringing me a serious person's autograph. Ah, oh, from Tanaka? Oh, my. Yeah. You've already fulfilled the requirement. No, Elizabeth, you're not a fan of that nerd. Oh, that's your, like, breadcrumb quest to get you to talk to Tanaka. Oh, oh clever designers. It says here, Tanaka's amazing commodities. Ah, it must be the prominent figure's autograph. I must say, he has a very beautiful penmanship. One of his very few talents. He must be as powerful as the rumors say. This man who rambles along to a unique melody. Marvelous. Oh, I meant that you acquired a new bond in addition to the autograph. That is very good news indeed. Take this. Yo, that's huge for us. I don't know we're going to fuse with that yet, but yo, that's amazing. Before I do anything, though, we got to get the upgrade of the century. Yeah, baby. I'm curious, what level does I guess arrive at? 110 attack on her weapon. It's actually below average, interestingly enough. How do we check, like, total stats? Level 27? What is Aki at? Oh my god. Oh, no, they're not that far off. That's that's totally fine. Also, I realized that was like, the most inefficient way to get that information. But, yo, I gotta check this out. What's going on in here? Our special 3,000 yen program will cleanse your soul and send you to heaven? Face your inner self and bring out what lies deep within you. I might be able to recall a forgotten person. Oh, okay. That's effectively useless right now. But it's cool it's in the game. You can also take a part-time job here, Monday through Friday. What do you do as the part-time job? I really want to check that out, but you can't apply for a job like this late at night. It's not going to happen. We will do that when we've exhausted everything else to do in the game. You have my word. Because right now it just makes no effing sense. Anyway. Gaming. We love it. Woohoo. Level six. We'll get there before you know it. And then. Oh, <laughs> and then. I'm not telling. But something good will happen. So definitely focus on it. Just saying. It is morning. Ah. I request that you wake up. That actually made me jump. What the? Jesus, that's creepy. You have successfully awakened. Mission complete. Yeah, I've done this before. I'm pretty good at it. <laughs> My alarm clock. What did you do to it? What? That was a gift. Did you destroy it? Was... It has not triggered yet. Then why'd you wake me up? Five minutes early is on time. Who filled your head with all these lies? That is the phrase posted on the wall. So I woke you five minutes before your alarm clock engages. Oh my god. My name is not that girl. Please address me as I guess. Oh yo, she got some sass. Huh? Um, oh my god, Yukori is gonna kill me. I guess? Oh. When did you I entered while he was asleep. Unlocking the door took two minutes. <laughs> Unlawful entry. <laughs> Didn't we tell you to stay in the command room at night? 
I determined that it is ideal to be on standby in this room. Is this a problem? Yeah, you went against your prime directive, I guess. I don't know. I do have a window, though, in fairness. What? Where is this coming from all of a sudden? If there is a problem, I will address it promptly. The problem? Well, it's probably against dorm regulations for one. Look, don't just stand there. Tell her. What are you getting mad at me for? Hello? I don't care. I'm going back to bed. <laughs> She's not allowed in here. It's not good. She needs to leave. I don't have a problem with it. Seems like you're the one with the problem. Okay, look. <laughs> I'll get a room set up for you on the third floor so you can stay nearby. Just don't leave the dorm by yourself, okay? I will do as commanded. As long as I can stay in this room. Yeah, okay. I'm tired. Alright, well, I have practice this morning, so I gotta get to school. Everyone here goes to a place called school in the morning. I comprehend. Alright, Gail, calm down. Yeah, back to class. I honestly forgot that we did go back to school, so... I'm kind of shocked. I, I don't have a game plan, I'll be honest with you. Social link was. So friggin' hot today! <sighs> so, uh, I've been thinking. If we do all the shadows and the dark hour disappears, what's gonna happen then? Hmm. Well, we won't have to kill them anymore. So, that'll be nice. Right? Huh? Well, yeah, but... Well, regular people don't even know about the dark hour to begin with, right? Means no one will even know about anything we've done. I mean, it'd uh, be a huge problem if they did, but it just kind of sucks, you know? Maybe Mitsuru will give you a check. Who knows, man? I don't, like... She honestly should! Think about it. Oh, yeah, what? The exam results are here! Also, leave... The Vikings are coming! Ah! I scored the highest in my grade? That's nonsense. Dude, I straight up... I got by by the skin of my teeth. Everyone's checking me out, so, you know, I'm not, not gonna complain. I keep, dude, one of these days. It, it, I, we're on the cusp of it, I swear. Come to think of it, Mitsu promised me a gift. I guess we'll have to go say hi. Best in the... We're 11th grade, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Was that again, Junior? What do they call him in this game? I guess they could just call him Grade 2. Anywho, how's you on your tests, studious student? I do wonder. It seems like the average score went down this time. I guess that's good for me, though. Honestly, I'm a little disappointed. I think I could have scored about 20 points higher. I'll have to study harder during vacation. Dang. I get that. On your grind set. Dude! I was trying to pick up some chicks the other day at the station. But it didn't go as planned. It's hard when a girl has her guard up, huh? Maybe a more honest approach would work better. Yeah, it's usually... Not a good idea to use lies and deceit to uh, get a female attention. Dang, your car's not here. What, what's going on? Summer sucks, man. I sweat so much my shirt gets drenched. Yeah. Same. I'm, I'm sweating in mine right now. So I think it's safe to say, every, say everybody, we are not going to the Arboretum. In reload. And that upsets me probably too much. I... Need to work on that. <laughs> what is in there? I don't even want to see it. I just want to know. Like, oh yeah, you know the the uh, the big building? Yeah. Oh, Mitsuru's not here either. Heck's going on? Classes are done. Or no, I mean exams are done. Weird. Oh, hey, Keisuke. Hey, Yuki. We're having a club activity today. So it brings you here. I'm gonna have a look around the school. I always see a few students who look unwell. Hopefully they're just lacking sleep, but there's a chance they could be sick too. Ah, sorry. Didn't mean to get carried away. Just keep an eye on your health, okay? Will do, boss. Oh, no, it's not me, super, super fan. I think of artists. I think of those who squint and hold a pencil up their subject. I used to do that, especially the guys in my class. I just want to look the part. They're such posers. Same. I heard there's a revenge website, but the URL's top secret, right? I'm trying to figure it out. 
So looking all over the web on my cell. There's a local thread that seems like it has a lot of info on the site. That's all garbage info. Hmm. I wonder why that guy wants to find it. My parents get on my nerves while the you better study crap. I'm gonna go out for summer vacation. I don't know if they'll let me. This sucks. Wait, we have summer vacation? Like for real, for real? I guess that is soon. Ah, oh, geez. Moment of truth, how screwed are we on our social links? Oh, dump, yeah, Fuka to the rescue. Let's go. But also before that, kitty time. Where you at? Y'all know it's been a while. You've been, yeah, all right. Yes, thank goodness. Cat is praying loudly, it seems so happy. It seems to have regained all its energy. Think it'll be okay without me now? They grow up so fast. Energetic kitty. Stay well. I thought those guys were a total loner. He knows those weirdos? <laughs> like it matters. I don't give two craps with who's friends with who. And yet I retained this information. I saw those weirdos talking to that a-hole Aragaki the other day. They tied us something? Huh? Enough of that. Lizzie, we finished. I see you successfully fed the hungry cat. That's a great relief. Thank you. I can feel relief in the very cockles of my heart. I hope it prospers forever and ever. Please take this as your reward. Male summer garb for everybody. Hoping. Also, yeah, let's uh, go on a date or you know <laughs> hang out. I'm taking our next destination to great consideration. Please wait a while until I've made up my mind. Wait what? Oh, I gotta take the request, I think, first. Mm, nope, that's not the case. I guess we just can't do it yet. Interesting why there's the option. Well, that's Very a bummer. Oh, well, I guess talk to Fuka. I didn't mean to say it like that, but you know what I mean. One is hazardous to our health, the other, Hello. not so much. Looks like we're finally done with exams. We made it to the end. Hopefully that relieves some stress at school for a while. By the way, you're leaving now. Would you like to go shopping with me? Shopping? For what? Thank you. Cookbook? Let's head to Polonia Mall. Sorry for taking so long. Uh, what? I wanted to buy something to use as a secret ingredient in my cooking. But I couldn't really decide, and I wasn't sure how to use whatever I'd buy. Did you buy- did, what did you buy from the pharmacy? What is the secret ingredient, Yamagishi? Tylenol? What? Do you really need one? Start with the basics, Fuka. Learn about cumin and oregano, okay? Yes, you're right. I'm sorry I'm lecturing, but please don't don't poison me. I haven't even gotten the basics down yet. I'm getting way too ahead of myself. First thing I need to do is find something that I can actually make. Still having a lot of trouble getting things right, but I can't give up yet. Not after all your support. And it's not like I have any other redeeming qualities. Is she fishing? Cause Fuka, you You're walking talking god. You give me them stinking luster candies, I'm I'm in there. Oh wait, they're not called luster candy in this. You give me the buffs, I eat them up, you know? Like that's all you your cook your persona's cooking! Okay? That's all you need to know. There's nothing you're good at? No, you're a hard worker, you're an angel, and you're caring. And it breaks my heart you don't think you have, like, abilities. My god. No, that's not true at all. Yeah, what'd you get on the last test? What'd you get? What'd you get? You did above average, didn't you? Yeah, cause you're the goat. I mean, everyone in our group works hard. Debatable. And beyond that, I think you all have something that you're good at. Yeah, right back at you. Sorry, that's reality. It's not up for, open for debate. I'm sort of good with machines, but that's it. It's honestly not worth mentioning. Really. I just happen to like them. It's not exactly something worth boasting about. When I was little, I remember my dad's hobby was to work on complicated sound equipment. He'd fix things like broken amplifiers or headphones that only played sound on one side. I've always loved watching him work on those things. Probably why I was drawn to working with machines in the first place. But 
I don't think that would be very useful to repay everyone's kindness. Plus, if we do ever have any technical needs, like when we're fighting, then we've always got the Kirijo group support. Not to mention that I'm kind of embarrassed about it all. I mean, it's not a very feminine hobby. Oh, brother. It's okay. She was in 2009, but... Why would you think that? That's not true. No, just just refute it. No, that's wrong! Later. You're saying girls can like robots too? Huh. Thank you. I got you. Don't n n say less. Just, you know, please work on the cooking too. I, I, not, not, not because you're a girl and you have to like cook. I'm just, I'm just saying. I sure seem to talk about my problems a lot, huh? I wonder why it's so easy talking to you. I feel like you stop me from being so negative all the time. Actually, I might owe a lot to you in that sense. I think Fuka trusts me now. You mean she didn't before? Have I said that every time? Probably. But yeah, it's, it's just a nice sweet scene. What did she get from the pharmacy though? I don't know, I wanna know. Oh, it's getting late. Sorry, I didn't mean to talk so much. Let's go home. I feel like some of these have been rewritten though. Cause not off tangent, but I remember a Yuko social link that was so short, I literally cut it out of the video, my original walkthrough. Cause she's like, I eat a lot, I'm gonna get fat. And you just say, you're not fat. And that's it, that's literally all that happens. It was two seconds long. Greetings. By the way, how'd you fare on your exams? Well, I don't wanna brag. <laughs> that's great news, I'm happy for you. That reminds me, Kurujo Senpai was at the top of her class again. I mean, where did she find the time? She's unreal. Excuse me. Like the engine this game is made in. In two weeks, the moon will be full again. Dude, those freaks with that precision will be everywhere. I, I wait. I mean, I mean the lost, <laughs> the victims. They're victims. I feel bad for the victims. I uh... seriously, it's like there's no end to them. That's a negative. Technically speaking. There is an end to them. Six shadows remain. If we can eliminate them, the dark hour will vanish. <laughs> yeah, that's true. So what you're trying to say, I guess, is that fighting is more important than studying, right? Oh, I agree 100%. Oh, brother, here he goes. Oh, yeah, I'm making a let's play. I, I'm, just, I'm just like, man, I, I really like these characters. If you didn't already know that. Sam scores, dude, I don't care about that. Being shadows is more important than getting good grades. Any time spent studying could be used to go to uh... Don't get carried away, Iori. You should still study. You can learn from defeat. That's something that goes for our battles against shadows as well. Genuinely don't think we've ever lost, like even come close to losing though. Uh, I have a question. When you attend your institution of schooling, what kind of emotions do you feel? Boredom. Regarding that. Is that true? From analyzing your facial expression, categorizing school as boring is inaccurate. Whoa! There's a lot more to it than just class. You didn't ask me about track. I like that. Um, Not so much, you know, quiz time. Okay, I like Mr. Ono. He, you know, he, he's all right. Can I help you? Kirijo Senpai is incredible. She scored so well on her exams, even though so much has been happening. She can filter out all distractions and focus on the task at hand. I wish I could do that too. Doesn't feel like it usually get good grades? I'm pretty sure we could check. No, I think it's only for our, like, grade. Yuki, I saw your exam results. Good work. This is from the chairman. Excellent. It's a reward for effectively balancing schoolwork as well as extra. Okay, it's just incredible. Whoa, level two though. Since I placed at the top of my exams, I got the Mega Master Band. Ooh, what the dump does that do? I'm actually excited. Mega, wait, Mega Master Band. Oh, oh yeah. That plus our sword, dude, our personas just got a lot stronger. That's huge. I'm nerding out, but dude, look how buff my slime is. <laughs> I'm gonna have the ladies. <laughs> look at him go. <laughs> From this angle, looks like he's eating Mutsuru's head like Pac-Man. 
I'm so stupid. Oh. You saw the exam results for us today, right? It's great if you did well, but maybe you didn't. Try not to worry too much. Everything that's been going on, I'm sure you did the best you could. Corey, I'm so, I'm so touched. Oh, that reminds Must be difficult to balance, blah, blah, blah. Perhaps summer school would be beneficial. Let's wait and see how the others did. Oh, great. So I did amazing. And now I gotta... Oh. It's been a while since I told return the favor. It's about time I pay up. Meet me in front of Iwatoda Station. How did my spidey senses go off that he wanted to hang today? Dude. So this is the rank two of the, the, the link. What are they called again? Link thing? Uh, also, how do I get... Oh, yeah. yeah. It's the wrong way to get to the station. It's not, like, totally intuitive, but this is how you do it. Yeah, my man, what's good? Yeah. Oh, Yuki. Today's the day I finally returned the favor. You're free? Dude, let's go. Yes. All right, let's do it. All right. This time, let's have a nice meal as we talk about our future battles. And you're talking about battle guns. Shadows, right? Like, we're not doing that Street Fighter thing anymore? Uh, what? You're the one who gets to do the fighting. Oh, that's stone. She like she didn't mean it, bro. I mean she did, but <laughs> can't we all just get along? Our future battles, huh? You doing alright? Uh, it's fine. Don't worry about it. First things first. Let's get some food. You know what they say, don't trust how you feel about your life but not after 9 p.m., all right? Don't, like... Hey, what's going on? Wait, what? Should we call somebody? There you are, Akihiko Sonata. You again? No. Oh, my God! Oh, you're the guys from before. You, and, and they're in a triangle formation. I guess the guy in the center is, like, you know, he's the leader or something? Turns out you're pretty famous, huh? An up-and-coming boxer, that it? Time to pick up where we left off. Show me what you got. No, dude, what about the police? We are, we promised Officer Kurosawa. Kicking your ass is gonna do wonders for our rep. No way we're gonna pass this up. Champ or not, look at our numbers. You ain't got a chance. Hmm. All right, Aki, I take one half, you take the other. No, I'm calling the police. This is stupid. It only take a second for us to beat the shit out of you. Uh, yeah, I don't think I can get to that payphone. Maybe you want to call an ambulance instead. <laughs> you said beating me would do wonders for your rep. I thought this was about testing each other's strength. You idiot. I'm just gonna have fun kicking your ass because you're full of yourself. And who the hell cares about any of that as long as you win? Isn't that how you roll too? It looks like a fight's gonna break out. I gotta do something. Slime? Could I could I summon slime? Would that help? So, you wanna go first or what? Uh, I don't want my evoker. Get back. No, come on, man. Officer! Oh my god! It's him! Kurosawa! Are you shitting me? Get back! <laughs> hey! Nobody runs away from us! Yo, good- oh, good moves, dude! Running away is easy enough. It's losing them, that's the hard part. Yeah, hopefully they don't- you know, they don't know where we live now. Still, made for a good workout, right? Yeah, but what about our food? Can we never go- like, are we ever gonna be safe? What's going on with that? That was some quick thinking, by the way. Just what I'd expect from our leader. Oh, stop. Running away is always an option. I don't exactly like turning my back to an opponent. But it doesn't matter in the end if I can't protect the ones beside me. And being outnumbered increases our risk of injury or damaging our surroundings. What I mean is, you made the right call. I owe you one. Hmm? What? Oh, I thought that was like diegetic, like because I ordered something. And then I realized I didn't. Heck is it? It's addressed to me. It says it contains. Fruits, snacks, and beverages. Looks like it's from my parents. I'll take it to my room later. Wait. What? What's going on? 
Yeah. My foster parents that adopted me. Oh. I haven't kept in touch lately since I'm so busy. But it sounds like they're doing well. I appreciate how much they care, but this is a little too generous. <laughs> Wanna take some of it off my hands? Yeah, man, all these snags can't be good for your training. I got you. I'll get some off your hands. And again, you'll hardly make a dent in this either. We can just share them with the whole dorm. Why not? Junpei could probably eat the whole box. Yeah, let's share it with everybody. Good idea. Would you mind gathering everyone up? <laughs> gotta stop screaming. What well, I was gonna scream was really funny. Is such high quality. I can tell just by looking. Your parents must really care about you. <laughs> At least you know how to behave in front of your parents, Akihiko. What? God dang, Mitsuru! Don't you ever have anything nice to say That's about me? That's what I'm saying. Well, we had it. We had a night. You're like oh, Akihiko, you're so crazy. Like. Mitsuru, can you cut me a break? My parents have been good to me. I obviously haven't told them about what we do here, though. Wow! When it comes to being considerate of others, you're a heavyweight. Glad to have you in our corner, senpai. There he goes again. He sure look good, though. Thanks for sharing, Sonata-senpai. Take whatever you want. Hey, the Rija's look really senpai. good. What's that? Uh. Going for that this one, huh? You get that. You have my thanks. Uh, even I guess? That took care of most of it. I'm surprised they were so happy. I've really got to show my gratitude. To my parents and to everyone here. Well, all this talk about my parents reminded me of some things from the past. Like, why I'm here right now. I guess I feel like I remember my reason for fighting. Out of here. I, mean, I don't really get it. Why would I ever say that? I can never do that. No, dude, like, I'm glad, yeah. Finding yourself. Well, don't mind me. Let's just say I've got a lot of room to grow. The dorm's gotten so much busier. The orphanage used to be something like this, too. We all lived under the same roof, just having casual conversations. I'd forgotten what it was like. But it wasn't so bad. I remembered after you suggested we share with everyone. Well, hey, it's always next time. You know, go to the corner store, do the same thing. Tell that to my parents. Uh, what? I really gotta repay you in particular, though. That didn't work. Or we'll never be squared away. All right, it's pretty late now. I guess we should clean up and call it a night. There's something mixed in here. It's a letter and some sort of handcrafted object. It's like a gold medal. It's made of cardboard. What? Is there something there? Yeah, I think uh, something you made when you were younger. Something like that. This is... Yours? It's gotta be, right? <sighs> so embarrassing. Oh. This medal doesn't really belong to anyone. It's from a long time ago. Oh. Do you mind if I ask you something? You take on the role of our leader, and you're stronger than anyone else in your own right. That's more than just being talented. Where do you get that strength from? The truth is... <sighs> so there's this guy, and he's got a long nose, um... Thanks to the bonds I have, I mean, that's the truth of it. That's just literally the truth. I see. You mean you feel motivated because you have people in your corner? No, there's like, I dream of this room and it's blue and it's... Bonds with others, huh? That might be something I'm missing. Hey, didn't we hang out or like, what the... What the... Well, whatever it is, you've clearly got something that I don't. The being jealous or trying to copy you isn't going to help me. That strength is yours alone. I'm going to get stronger, but I'll do it my way. Sorry, we were supposed to be cleaning up. I'll take care of the rest. Things got so busy that I missed out on my chance to thank you again. Hopefully the food was enough for today. I'll invite you out again some other time. Dude, please. This... This ruled. This is new information for Akihiko. I, I just want to state that. To my knowledge, he never talked about his foster parents before. 
I'm eating this up. And I'm not talking about the treats. Oh my god. That was the best thing ever. I took Sanaa's gesture of appreciation. I returned to my room. I feel like my charm has improved it. Oh, you don't say. I didn't even know I was going to get that. Not bad. Not bad at all. Man, we're popular now? Shoot. <sighs> Such an amazing game. And would you believe there's even more to it? Oh my god. I still, you know, just saying it. There are some things that I know we're going to be in the game that we haven't seen yet. I'm really looking forward to that. Dude, summer break starts tomorrow. It's prime time for a little beachside romance. You know, what other guys would kill to be in our shoes? After all, we're staying in the same dorm as three super cute girls. I think so too, right? You mean four super cute girls, Junpei. I think you're forgetting somebody. But who cares? Come on, Junpei. I treat everyone equally. You know. Oh, yeah. Ah, come on. You can be honest with me. What's your type? Girls that treat me like garbage. They drag me out to the side of the road. Throw me in the back of a truck. Take me to a waste management facility. And bury me underground. Uh, yeah, we're gonna be late for class. Let's, uh, uh well, if you wanna be more than friends, you got, got a lot of work ahead of you. Can we just senpai the top of the class in student council press? You have to be uber nerd for her to give you the time of day. Yukatan's pretty popular. You gotta be as styling as she is to be a good at match. And Vuka, well, she's soft spoken and kinda hard to grasp. She might need to take the initiative with her, I guess. Yeah, anyway, give us hush hush between us. Junpei acting as the, like, information broker from a dating game. That's kind of funny. Ah, oh, come on, I'm trying this episode this year! Ito Gawa, can't freaking... Leg your seat, solete o gale salve, rather. Your teacher has suddenly fallen ill, so I'm filling in today. Sick of the last day before summer vacation. That just shows you why you have to take good care of your health. <laughs> anyway, I'll be giving you a crash course on alchemy, a branch of magic focusing, among other things, generating wealth. I uh, like the sound of that, do you? Of course, who among us would turn down free money? It's human nature to want what one lacks. There's no escaping it. So despite the lesson imparted to us by King Midas, humans have long sought for a way to create precious materials for themselves. However, the alchemists of old were not so arrogant as to believe they could create gold by touching anything they pleased. Rather, they sought a process that allowed them to convert cheap or materials, such as iron and copper, into more lucrative ones. This goal is the pinnacle of alchemy in given form, the Philosopher's Stone. Regardless of their incentive of their success, there is no denying that alchemists have made significant impacts in world history. The root of alchemy originates in Hellenic Egypt, the city of Alexandria at its center. As the Western Roman Empire fell, alchemy thrived in Arabia. Many of the Arab er, Arab Arabic alchemical texts written at the time were, have survived to this day. The earliest English translation of these texts brought the practice of medieval Europe, where alchemists gained both power and infamy. Also of note, there is a fascinating branch of Chinese alchemy called Wei Dan. These practitioners sought a working formula for an elixir of immortality. Though, rather than a recipe for gold, at any rate, the most important substances to practice alchemy were mercury or quicksilver. It was thought that mercury could be used to form the Philosopher's Stone, which would in turn allow alchemists to generate gold. Alchemists endlessly toiled in their research using all sorts of equipment and experimental approaches. There are some who argue that if not for the alchemist's trial and error, modern chemistry would not exist for today. Unfortunately, there's no definitive proof that a Philosopher's Stone was ever successfully created. In a way, it's one of the greatest tragedies of human history. Moving on, alchemy has been very influential in the field of psychology. Carl Jung? <gasps> it's him! It's him! They referenced him! Among others, recognize a kinship between alchemists and psychologists. Jung believed that psychotherapy could refine a mind to a stronger, healthier state. Not like the Philosopher's Stone was said to affect metals. Feeling sleepy, even though this is genuinely interesting to me. As such. Which is why... I think it's such a shame that mainstream society has given up on alchemy. Young adults ought to strive for unusual goals. It offers the best chance to lead exciting lives. And after all, for the perspective of our ancestors, modern science may as well be alchemy or magic. You work hard enough, you may very well discover your own form of magic. 
Well, that's it for now. Enjoy your summer, everyone. Thanks, dude. Last time I heard, though, alchemy was like... It was almost like a way of to enlightenment. The alchemical gold, that is. Not necessarily like to just make something. It kind of goes with Buddhism, right? It's like, oh no, I've, I've achieved pure enlightenment. Hey, you have a minute? Uh, what? what? It's about the track team. Since you just transferred, you probably haven't heard about the Miyoho Cup, right? What? What is this? I, I guess I haven't. Well, let me tell you. On August 2nd, there's a major competition for track and field. There's this guy named Hayase. Total speed demon. We can't let him trounce us this year. Got high hopes for you, so get ready to train hard. Uh, will do, coach. I'm gonna need you to show up from July 27th to August 1st. Don't go skipping school now. Hey, yo, that's a lot of time. I've got a special training regimen in mind for you. ISA won't stand a chance. I guess I have to do this, though. Competition's on August 2nd. Let's do this thing. Y yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm really just going to hang out with Cause, though. I'll be honest with you, sir. Huh. <sighs> Speaking of Cause, yeah. I see you holding up. Guess we can't find out. So this is the... Oh. Oh. Today's the day we can do this too. Oh my god, this episode's too long. Guys, this game is great. I love it. Yakushima in reload. Blew my expectations out of the water. Akihiko's, like, link thing, whatever the crud you want to call it. Amazing. Oh my god. I love this game so much. And I hope you do too. More episodes coming soon, alright? Bye.